Make America Great Again, and Joe Biden truly is making it's great. Bad. If an entire town gave Donald Trump's presidency, because Joe Biden has gave you a bigger tax savings than Donald Trump did. All you heard the right wing propaganda that all oh, your taxes was gonna skyrocket with Joe Biden. You got sold the billionaire con that this was all a tax cut on the working people instead of the billionaires. The tax cuts for billionaires happens under Republican presidencies. The trillion dollar American Rescue Plan lowers Americans' tax bill by an average of $33,600, while the Trump tax cuts only reduce the tax bill by $1,600. So with Biden, you save more than double what you saved with Donald Trump. It doesn't stop there. 67% of the tax savings under the Biden plan go to the lowest 60% of earners. The top 20% get minor, minuscule tax cuts under the Joe Biden plan. 67% of the savings go to the majority of the working people of this country. The billionaires are right-wing billionaire, Freedom Works, Cato, Libertarian, billionaire shills, the lower 60% under Trump, instead of saving 65%, captured just 17% of the tax cuts, while the billionaires, the top 20%, get 65% of the tax savings. So how do you explain this? 67% of the tax savings with Biden go to the lowest 60% of earners, whereas 65% of the benefit goes to the top 20%. How do you explain dumb, retarded, working-class America voting against their best interest, which is what they're doing when they fall susceptible to conspiracy theories and the lack of seeking fact and reason in the pursuit of knowledge? The lowest quintile received the majority of the benefits under the Rescue Plan Act, Despite the right-wing lie, the billionaire lie that only 9% goes to the American people, what you guys are believing is billionaire propaganda. Tax cuts for the wealthy happens with Republicans. Republicans are not in power right now. The trial tax credit is a big winner. We go from 2000 to 3000 to 3600 for the uh, ch child tax cut credit under the stimulus bill. This is exactly what you're seeing right now. But is the game over? No. This is temporarily. This is happening until this is this is only going to happen up until 2022. I guarantee you if the Republicans win the House or the Senate, this will not be permanent. This, this, these will not be permanent provisions at all. This is guaranteed to relieve child poverty by one third. I don't believe it's going to reduce child poverty by one third, but it is going to relieve child poverty by one third. And when you put money into the hands of the people that need it the most, they will spend and stimulate the economy. We need to say no to Ronald Reagan billionaire trickle-down bullshit because it is bullshit at the end of the day. It's time to put an end to that. But I guarantee you, progressives need to put the pressure on Joe Biden and the establishment. It is not enough. You need to make this permanent. You all have to go out and vote in the midterms. Do you want another right-wing billionaire crash like what happened last year? Then you know what you have to do. You need to do what's right to stimulate the economy behind the people that 
drive the economy, that run the grocery stores, that run the car washes, that run the automobile repair shops, that run the restaurants, that run the hospitals, that run the firefighters. It's these people that make America not it is. Not the billionaire fat cat trust fund, uh, let's sit on the money that we just, we just bet on the stock market. These people don't run America.